What does my shirt say? That's a sharp, not a hashtag. And I don't know what it means. Well, let me see if I can explain it to you. Well, a sharp, okay, there are three kinds of uh, key signatures in, in, on a music grand staff. The sharp, it looks like this. A flat sign, it looks like that. And a natural, okay, a flat sign, okay, you ready? Look at this. A flat goes like that, and then that. And then a natural sign, like that, 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 and close that. Well, it's all music. Yeah, and then a hashtag, okay, have you ever seen on Instagram, like, okay, like, if you're gonna tag someone in a post, the, um, like, you would use this symbol. And what is that symbol called? Well, in Instagram, it's a hashtag. That means you're you're including someone in your post, like, like this, like the hashtag, and then say Mary Eunice Durham, and then we had a fun time. But it's also known as you see, we're tr I'm a musician, and this is a musician's joke, and we're trying to convince you that it's a music symbol and not a plain ordinary phone symbol or social media symbol. Okay. Well, you get the idea. Get the idea. So, what have you been doing today? What is today? <laughs> is it Sunday? Saturday. Saturday. Yeah. I, I would have seen Holland Oats today, but. You what? I would have seen a band called Holland Oats today. They're an 80s band. A band from the 1980s. Okay. Anyways, they're a 1980s band called Holland Oats, and I really wanted to see them, but they're in Nashville, and I'm out of town. And trains growing with them. Why too. are you? Why are you here? Because my parents are out of town. Why are they going? They got. They went to Liberty Con. That's somewhere in Chattanooga. Is it a musical thing? No, it's not a musical thing. I think it's Chattanooga. It's either Chattanooga or Memphis or it's somewhere. In, in Tennessee. But anyways, what have you been doing? Today? Yes. Well, I got up and I had breakfast. Had a bath and got dressed. And y'all came. I guess. You haven't done much since we came? Y'all what? You haven't done much since we came? You haven't done much since you came. I've just been kind of done what I'm told. What's that desk over there? What is it? Was that your husband's desk? No. I don't know. That desk with my father's picture on it and the lamp. I can't say where that came from. But uh, I'm not betting a hundred dollars. Okay. Well. What have you done today? Well, uh. Got up, you know, had breakfast, took a shower, got dressed, and then my grandmother woke up by... What, you had breakfast before she got up? Yeah. What well, did you have? I had some toasted oats, or oat Cheerios, made out of oat meal. Not, not porridge oatmeal, but it's like cornmeal or wheat meal, only it's, you know, like from oat flour. And you make it into Cheerios and you eat it. It's really good. Maybe I'll buy you some toasted oats sometime. Mm -hmm. Well, what are your plans for the rest of today? Just be here. Let it what happens happens. Whatever will be will be. Kesara sara. Oh. <laughs> you said that in a dream one time when you were talking to my great grandfather. W.A. Durham Jr. I'm almost finished. Uh, so, uh, now, um, what are your plans for your 98th birthday in July? Well, that'll be my, my next birthday. I'll be 98. Yeah. That's getting close to 100, isn't it? I, hopefully, two more years, you'll be a century, a centenarian. 
Well, it was our field. Up for it? Up to it, yeah. Up to it, yeah. Good work, wasn't it? Well, well, and the best of luck to you, I... Well, thank you so much. You're a great grand... great... you're a great, great grandson. Is that right? Uh, no, I'm your great grandson, but I am great. <laughs> <laughs> well, I, that's... Is that all? you just one great? Yeah, I'm one great. That's you. You're a good interviewer. Thank you. Thank you. So, um, one more question. Okay. Sure. Okay. She gave you some straw. My grandmother gave you some strawberries. What did you do with those strawberries? She gave me some strawberries for Mother's Day. What did you do with the strawberries? I guess I ate them. <laughs> well, okay. <laughs> I'm pretty sure we've said all there is to say, haven't we? Huh? We've said all there is to say. I think so. Well, that's our little contribution for this week. And remember, it's better to ride one block in a Rolls Royce than to walk five miles. It depends on your point of view.